Hello everyone. Today I brought parts of a speech. Practice it. So this is we all know that there are eight parts of a speech. We know their names also, examples also. But while doing the questions, sometimes we just get stuck because same word can be different part of a speech. It depends on the sentence only. I mean to say. Sometimes a word can be adverb and another time the same word can be adjective or it can be noun, right? So keeping this point in my mind, today I have brought some practice questions for you that will be extremely helpful for you. And after watching this video, you will not be get stuck, I hope, on any of the question. So without further delay, let's get started. First question is, please pass the bowl. So here you can see, you have to tell the bold word of which part of the speech. Means you have to tell, you have to identify the part of the speech of the bold word. So here the bold word is pass, right? So pass the bowl. Here you can see pass is a verb, right? And this... Please pass the ball. This is imperative sentence and here passes the verb, right? So there is no doubt, I think, pass is the verb here, right? Please pass the ball. So pass is verb. Next one, that was a good pass. So here the same word again, pass, but it is now not a verb. That was a good pass. So what do you think? This is a Password is of which part of the speech? Guess your answer. That was a good pass. So here pass is a noun. Because that was a good pass. So you can see ki this is just like uh, it is clearly uh, means we can easily identify this is a noun not a verb right. Next is watch the movement of the players closely. So, if we study the sentence carefully, so it is clear to us that watch is here a verb. Again, the imperative sentence and watch means to look at something, right? So, look at the moment of the players closely. We can also say watch the moment of the players closely. So, here the given verb is a given word is a verb, right? Watch the moment of the players closely. So, here watch is a verb now again the same word watch is that your new watch so here it is verb noun adjective or adverb just guess your answer is that your new watch i hope it's easy to identify that watch is here a noun we are just Talking about the watch that we usually wear and just look at time in that. Next one is identify the part of speech of bold word in the given sentence. And the sentence is the price of gold fluctuates. So fluctuates means ups and downs, right? So price of gold. So here gold is a noun which is a material noun, right? Material nouns are the nouns that in which talk about any metals, right? All the metals comes in the category of material noun. Material noun like metals, substances, things that we cannot count, out, right? So gold is a noun. The price of gold fluctuates. So gold is here, noun. But if we see the sentence, she doesn't like wearing gold rings. So here gold is not a noun. Same word is there, gold, but now it's not a noun because she doesn't like wearing a gold ring. So here the gold word is describing rings. Which kind of rings she doesn't like? She doesn't like gold rings. So here gold is an adjective because it is describing ring. So, she doesn't like wearing a gold rings. This is an adjective. Next is, she is reading a weekly magazine. She is reading a weekly magazine. 
so here you can see the bold word is weekly so we have to identify in which part of the speech is this word weekly weekly magazine what kind of magazine weekly which magazine me uh, weekly so here also the word weekly is just describing magazine right so weekly is here what weekly is here adjective because the word that describes a noun or pronoun is called adjective and here magazine is a noun and the word which is describing it that is weekly so weekly is here adjective but just look at the sentence now this magazine is published weekly so again the word weekly is here but now is this adjective or some other part of a speech magazine is published weekly right so when did this magazine magazine publish weekly so here the parts of a speech noun verb adjective or adverb published weekly means when did this magazine publish so here it is the word weekly is just describing a verb that is published right it is telling when and right? so this is adverb of time right so here the weekly word is adverb because it is describing a verb and whenever a word describes a verb so it is called adverb right now look at the next sentence she is a lovely lady what kind of lady is she lovely so here lovely word is a verb noun adjective or adverb guess your answer lovely is adjective because it is telling what kind of lady is she it is just telling about the nature of the lady and lady is a noun so this word lovely is describing a noun that is lady so here lovely is an adjective but now in the sentence my grandmother still looks lovely now again having the same word lovely but still this is an adjective do you think no this is not an adjective actually this is adverb because again it is describing the verb that is look how does my mother how does my grandmother look lovely so here the word lovely is an adverb right i hope you got all the parts of the speech means we have to just read the sentence carefully and check the position and the role of the word in the sentence whichever is asked to identify and then we have to identify we cannot keep it in our mind ki this word is only noun so this is every time this is noun no this can be adjective also this can be adverb also it depends on the sentence means same word can be different part of the speech in the different time mainly we get confused between noun verb adverb and adjective i hope you are getting me if yes do like this video and do not forget to subscribe our channel for such a more videos thanks for watching